Hello, today we will look into Lorentz force. Lorentz force is a fundamental force or the building block of electromagnetism. Here, you, here is a 3D representation of an electron gun, a circular coil known as the Helmholtz coil. You have two uh, power switch. One, must, one supplies the uh, necessary power to generate the high energy electrons and the other generates the uniform magnetic field. When you switch on the uh, current, you see that high energy electrons are emitted through from the filament. These electrons travels in a straight path and the blue arrow as shown in this left, uh, left hand representation, this blue arrow or our index finger or the second finger did, uh, is pointing along the direction of the electron, right? Now, here you have no um, magnetic field present. Now, when you switch on the uh, supply for the coil, you see that the magnetic field acts in this direction given by the um, green arrow. The force is perpendicular to it. We use left hand, hand for an electron. If you have a positive ion, suddenly if you have a source which, gener which generates a positive ion or a positron or a positive charge, then use uh, the direction of the force will be opposite to it. You can use the right, the, uh, your right hand to represent that. The current flows through the coil, a magnetic field generates and then a force acts on these moving charges and the, the path now taken by the electron is in this circular path and this circular path uh, or the radius of this circular path actually depends upon the energy of these electrons if you if the energy of the, the velocity of the particles were higher it would transpose a much more higher circular path uh, or if you have a lower energy the path taken would be much smaller now the force which acts is perpendicular to both the velocity of the electron and the uh, magnetic field direction. Here it is in the upward, uh, upward direction represented by this red arrow. Right? And the electrons are is now moving in an anticlockwise direction. If you change the polarity of the magnetic supply, you can see that the now the magnet is, the direction of the magnetic field is in this direction. The electron will be moving in the clockwise direction, clockwise. Lorentz force is a fundamental uh, force in under force and it is uh, required for us to understand the electromagnetism and it um, describes the interaction between the charged particles and the electromagnetic field. Electromagnetic field, both magnetic and the, um, the our electrostatic field. Uh, what you need to understand is that the Lorentz force is always perpendicular to both the uh, velocity and the, this is a perfect example of cross products of vectors, right? So that is all regarding this 3D visualization which you can find here at uh, effectual.com or effectual.github.in. Do visit the website and uh, 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 give a uh, feedback on how you feel about it while you uh, read the topic. So just don't uh, uh, look into the formulas and how it works. Try to understand what uh, cross product means and how the particles in a magnetic field uh, particle moving particles are acted upon in a magnetic field. This is an uh, important uh, electromagnetic principle or uh, force and uh, is used in many devices like cyclotron and particle acceleration. So that's all for uh, today's video. See you in the next three interactive simulations. Thank you.